This is your local news brief for Friday, March 19, 2021. The city of Pasadena reports 11,061 total COVID-19 cases and 329 COVID-related deaths as of March 18. Despite limited vaccine supply, the city also reports that 43,000 Pasadena residents have received at least one dose and that over 21% of residents are fully vaccinated. It has now been a year since safer at home orders first went into effect. As COVID rates continue to fall, the county is moving toward the orange tier, but must first have two consecutive weeks with a case rate of 3.9 per 100,000. On Tuesday, March 16th, the rate was 4.1 per 100,000. Pasadena officials believe the city will receive about $50 million in federal coronavirus relief funds. Some city council members have expressed a desire to see the money go towards a number of items, including infrastructure projects and affordable housing improvements. Other council members and city manager Steve Mermel said that covering the city's existing expenses should be the top priority. Mayor Gordo argues the top priority should be refilling the city's depleted reserve of funds. However, he also urged his colleagues to consider infrastructure projects. According to a presentation from assistant city manager Julie Gutierrez, the funds cannot be used toward pensions or tax reductions. They are specifically earmarked for losses the city incurred, but can also be used to pay essential workers, provide assistance to businesses, and for investments in broadband, water, or sewer infrastructure. The Pasadena Teachers Union and the Pasadena Unified School District have agreed to push back the district's reopening date. Hours before the agreement, the union issued a cease and desist order to PUSD objecting to the district's plans to reopen for in-person instruction at the end of the month. Under the new agreement, schools will begin a hybrid simultaneous learning model. Pre-K through second grade will return to campus immediately after spring break on April 13th. Third through fifth grade will return on April 20th. Pasadena School Board President Scott Phelps said, after working collaboratively with our labor partners during the COVID-19 pandemic, we are pleased to reach an agreement for pre-K to fifth grade that keeps our students and employees safe and reflects the thoughtful care that has characterized our district's response to this crisis. <laughs> 